This is Pimped Out, where we take unsuspected clients' cars and give them a whole new look. Stay tuned. Brian, I got our next VIP. He's on his way. Okay. Dodge Durango. Awesome. I'll go get everything ready. Thank you. So we're here just for the recall? Yes. Okay. Jose Morales, right? Already right, follow me to my desk, please. And this is your copy here, and then you're good to go. Awesome, and then I'll just give you a call soon as the vehicle's ready. Okay. All right, no, you're welcome. You have a good day. So this specific customer here that I chose, his name is Jose Morales. The reason why I chose him is because uh, he's been a long time customer here with us since uh, the old store, Motor Village LA. Now with LACDJR, he continues to be a loyal customer. Um, not only does he bring his vehicle in for service, he's also purchased his vehicles here. So um, this is the reason why I feel that he's entitled for this gift. Okay, so tell me about our special VIP. This VIP here, um, he's purchased uh, multiple cars from the dealership here. He just purchased the 2021 Dodge Charger for his wife. Okay. I believe two, three months ago. Um, another loyal client. Another loyal client, yes. They have a Dodge Journey. The brother has a Chrysler 300. He just so it's a purchased. family of Dodges, family. huh? <laughs> yep, it's a family and they've been coming here for many years. Okay. Um, so they purchased and they service their vehicles here. This so. looks like easy. new still. This looks like easy work right here. Yeah, I mean, I thought you were gonna really challenge me this time. So what do you think? What's he into? What does he like? I know he's into the Dodgers. So I would say let's put some blue stripes on it. Mm. You know what? That's my your job? job. I know, I know. <laughs> you pimped it. Maybe we get rid of the chrome. Yes. We do some kind of blue, maybe a little bit more than blue stripes, maybe okay. like a graphics package. Yes. They make a custom grill kit for this. I'll look into it. And then we'll refresh these headlights and I'll have it done by Friday. Awesome. Let's do All it. right, deal. Looking forward to doing this Durango. Yep. Okay, guys. I just okay. met with Suhei. We got our new VIP build. Nice. It's a 2013 Dodge Durango. Cool. Um, it is in great shape. Um, I'm open to suggestions on this one. I mean, he's a Dodgers fan. I think for sure we should do something with the wheels and tires. If yep. we can add exhaust, I would add exhaust. There's okay. some damage on the front bumper. I think we can get that pulled off and sent to the shop yep. and get that fixed. Um, come up with some kind of stripe or graphic or something cool to, to wow it, but not over wow it. Yep. If you want to call Continental, get us some Continentals yeah, here. Yeah, for sure. And so. then I don't, what's your thoughts on the wheels? I mean, I know. So, so those wheels are very nostalgic to the old Viper. Right, so I think that if we play with those wheels, maybe color code them, you're saying Dodgers, maybe we do them in blue. Okay. We can go through, sandblast these wheels, we can powder coat them, and then we can get the right performance tires that should match those wheels, put them on the Durango, that kind of gives it the right stance. Okay. And then Musa, you can put together maybe a graphics package in yeah. blue that matches the wheels, and then Juan can come in and do his magic with the knifeless tape and, and all the vinyl and make it look like, you know, maybe like a brand new Hellcat Durango. The grill's a little weathered, so maybe okay. we can do that mesh. We can get yeah. the guys to paint the mesh blue. For sure. Or if they make an aftermarket grill. But yeah. let's make this one simple. We'll get it in and out. We have till Friday. Short time stream. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> That's what we do. Let's all right. do it. it all right simple graphic package stripe getting all the grill and all the chrome black we're doing the honeycomb here blue okay. keep the dodge keep that wheel because i think i like that wheel yeah sand and black will be the roof okay and this line right here which i kind of because if you see the body line on the right it kind of have that it wanted to continue to the rear quarter and then so yeah we just looks like a big window. yeah basically yeah that yeah, looks that's good. overall that yeah simple clean yeah 
think he'll like that. Mm -hmm. It's a refresh. Yeah. All right, let's get him to work. Let's do it. On today's episode, what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be pulling the front bumper, then I'm going to pull the wheels and tires so we can send those out to be powder coated. Next in process is gonna be Juan. He's gonna start wrapping the vehicle. Stay tuned. I'm gonna go ahead and remove the headlights because they're a little fogged up. So I'm gonna send them out to the shop and we're gonna go ahead and restore these headlights so they look brand new. All right, so Jay brought everything back from paint. We got our grill, we got our headlights, and they look awesome, very bright. We got all the internal pieces, and Juan took care of the grill surround and the lower valance, he wrapped those. So it's time to get this stuff on because we have a deadline. Uh, tenemos este Durango, ahora que mi amigo Musa diseñó el diseño, todo eso. So tenemos, trabajamos en el techo, satin black, Todo el cromado, va a ser satin black, cromado que ven aquí, satin black, hicimos eso y dimos un toque que es en el hood, hicimos a, a la, las líneas en color azul y en el bumper también vamos a hacer en color azul, como ver más o menos los béisbol de LA Dodgers y vamos a trabajar en esa hora, estamos. Dodgers thing that we're doing on this Durango. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these wheels and I'm going to wrap them in General Grabber UHPs. So these Grabber UHPs are directional. That means you have a right side tire and you have a left side tire. So one important thing when you mount the tires is you have to make sure you're not putting on three rights or three lefts. You have to do two rights and two lefts. Hi, Jose. How are you? Good. Yeah? You good? Yeah, Friday. Right I, I know it is, I know it is. Um, right now they're doing like construction on to where they bring down the cars. So I'm gonna take you through a different way to pick okay. up your truck, okay? okay. Um, and I'm gonna take you through uh, upstairs and that way we can pass by uh, West Coast Customs. Have you seen the West Coast Customs upstairs? Yeah? Well, Jose, I wanna, I wanna mention something to you, okay? Um, 
because we appreciate your loyalty. Okay. We have a little surprise for you. Okay? okay. This You're is a special Ryan. VIP. He wanted to meet you, by the way, Ryan. Hold on. I told him, I told him, oh, okay, well, we'll see if he's here. So here he is, yeah, the I famous Ryan. Oh, good. Nice to meet you. <laughs> so we have a special surprise for you. So um, you are a VIP client here at the dealership. Okay. This is my partner in crime right here, okay? Yes. <laughs> she chose you to be our next okay. VIP. So your Durango is right inside. I don't know if you knew, but we have a miniature West Coast Customs here. So we took your Durango up here and did a couple things to it. So we didn't want to do too much because this is a surprise, obviously. So we don't want, you know, our VIPs to be like, why'd you do this? What did you do to this? So we tastefully do some upgrades. We knew you were a Dodger fan. Well, I didn't know. My partner knew. <laughs> she said, mask. Ryan, he's a, he's a Dodger fan. <laughs> now I see the mask. So I'm like, all right, great. So we wanted <laughs> to add some Dodger flavor to it with some West Coast Customs touches and just make it, give it a little bit of a refresh for you. We did some stripes, cleaned up the paint, powder coated your factory wheels, did some white caliper covers. Just kind of just gave it a couple little touches, you know, to make it a little more special for you. I was gonna do some stuff that I seen you guys do. <laughs> wow. So we read your mind. Yeah. <laughs> so, I, I, <laughs> <laughs> wow, you guys did that. Uh, so we honestly. we okay? We oh, we do yeah. good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Well, good. That means we did a good job then. Oh, heck yeah. You know, thank you, thank you. we didn't want to change your wheels because we felt like these are you bought these wheels for a reason, you know. And Lorenzo brought that point up. It's like these are like the their Viper style rims, right? Viper yeah. Style wheels He's like, we should just color Maybe match them or do something. I've had a lot of compliments about the rims. You know, I've seen other trucks. But we put new Continental tires on it, so you got new tires. Uh, we got it since 2013, which is the, the year of the model of the truck. Uh, I've been coming to downtown uh, Dodge and Jeep because I love the service. Honestly, as soon as you walk in, you know, they welcome you. Uh, any special requests or concerns that I have, you know, great service advisors. Um, I have, uh, you know, a big girl. She's great. I always come to her. I always schedule with her and Suhaid, you know, any needs for transportation or any concerns that I have, they're always there for me. So, I mean, I'm getting to know them. I appreciate it. And like I said, all the services they do and they provide, it's, it's amazing. What are you gonna most likely be doing after this with your Durango? You oh man, show it off. <laughs> I gotta show it off, you know. It's, it looks beautiful. Uh, like I said, I have some, some things in mind that I wanted to do. And I mean, they basically, without knowing, uh, they read my mind. That's some things that I wanted to do. It's, a, it's an amazing surprise that they actually did it for me. And wow, I'm just, I'm shocked speechlessly. It's, it's, it's amazing. We want this to be special for you. And, and, you know, hopefully there'll be another one. You never know since you own so many cars from here. I mean, you never know. We might choose yeah, you again. Yeah, yeah, <laughs>
All right, let's go.